Hello, this is Kristen Lamb with a public service announcement for all you writers and your other 27 personalities. I know what you're thinking. You see the space background. You're thinking she's hiding in her son's space tent. And you'd be right. But it's also for effect because we are going to boldly go where no writing class has gone before. So where, might you ask, are we boldly going? I have a new class called Beyond Bulletproof Barbie, writing strong female characters from modern world. See, us gals have gotten a bit of a bad rap. We went from one trope, the damsel in distress, who was utterly useless and yet decorative, and tripped and fell face first into an equally horrible trope. And the only thing that shocks me about the whole thing is that we didn't break our ankle on the way to holding an AR-15. The new female action hero has definitely moved away from the damsel in distress, except for now she's bitter with bullets. She's got a cleavage and a katana, contouring and camouflage, kitten heels, and an urge to kill. She's good at everything, speaks 15 languages. She can hold a grown man pinned against the wall with a six inch stiletto heel and punch him in the face without ever breaking a nail. And she has a personality as deep as a puddle. Women have a variety of different strengths, abilities, backgrounds, occupations, and bring a lot more to the table other than punching everyone in the face except for every 28 days when we kind of want to. That was totally sexist, but I'm a girl, so I can say it. This class is designed not only to teach you how to write a more multi-dimensional and layered character who exhibits strength in a variety of different ways. Does she use her intellect? Does she use brawn? Does she use her intellect to trick other people into using their brawn? Because Girls are really good at tricking people. If you don't believe me, check out the pattern. In the end, the goal of this class is to open up your idea of what a strong female character might happen to look like. Cause she might look a lot like your mom. Ever get in the way of a mom and her kid? That's asking to die. There's a reason Spawn's not bullied. Ultimately, the goal of Beyond Bulletproof Barbie is to help us get out of this assembly line action hero character and use that imagination and creativity to create characters that are living, breathing, real people who we can't wait to spend more time with, even though they like to shoot people in the face. Or not. She has choices, the point of the class. Then I'm gonna go now. See you in class.